Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today's episode will be playing Marvel Champions the Living Card Game. Also, if you're wondering what this is right here, we got the blue microphone by Yeti. Wanted a little bit better audio quality, so this will be our first test. Uh, let me know down in the comments what you think, if it's too quiet, too loud, too grainy. I am not a mix master. I don't know anything about this stuff, so please let me know down in the comments. Uh, today's Marvel Champions playthrough will feature... Rocket Raccoon Justice going up against Claw. Standard. And in this episode, we just kind of play through. We're testing out some different heroes. We're just trying to get a good feel. I want to get the uh, uh, Most Galaxy Who's Wanted expansion to the table, and I want to try to find a good fit for that. So we'll be playing Rocket. We'll be playing Star-Lord. Maybe Thor as Guardians of the Galaxy type thing. Anyways, enjoy the playthrough. Let's get started. All right, welcome back down to the table. We have our rocket raccoon ready to go. We're going up against Claw Standard. He's got 12 hit points. He's got one, uh, two scheme rather, zero attack, but he does get an additional boost card for every activation when he attacks. And we are doing the main scheme, underground distribution. The attack on the shield facility has been linked to an underground weapons network. So we have the Masters of Evil in there, and we are going to search the encounter deck for the defense network side scheme and reveal it, shuffle that encounter deck, go to stage 1B. Your investigation reveals that the criminal enterprise is operated by Claw, an old rival of the Avengers. When revealed, discard cards from the encounter deck until minions are discarded put that engaged the first player. So first, we're going to look for the defense network, which is right here. This is going into play. And that comes in with three threat on there. Then we're going to shuffle up. And then we're going to discard cards until we get a minion and we put that into play with us. So Claw, even for a base game standard mode, really does put you behind the ball pretty early. But he's only got 12 hit points, so we'll see what we could do. Let's see. Minion. Minion. There it is. Uh, character enters. Play with tough. The guard, the armored guard, tough minion. Rocket Raccoon, he has a hand size of six, nine hit points only, so a little lighter. We'll have to be mindful of that as we progress, not to stay in hero form too long. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's see what we get here. Ooh, Sonic Rifle. Uh, can confuse it. Ready each tech. Ooh, an ally off the jump. That would be pretty huge to get us going here. Um, one way or another. Two damage to the villain. If there is no threat on the main scheme. Five damage. That's pretty big. But I gotta get rid of this guy first. Under surveillance. All good stuff. Alright, let's see what we got. Let's see what we can do first. Um, these are all hero actions. I would like to get it under surveillance out, but I think I'm going to do reload and sonic rifle. We're going to get under surveillance. So now we have a 10 threshold on this. Um, to thwart. To the villain. Um, let's, you know what? This is crazy, but let's go one way or another. Let's. There it goes. Let's uh, reveal a side scheme and draw three cards. Let's see if we can find. Um, you know what? 
Let's go Immortal Claw. It's going to come with three. It's going to give an additional ten. And acceleration. It's kind of crazy, but let's see what happens. So three there, and we get to draw three cards. One, two, three. Ooh. Ooh. All right, so if we flip over we can attack for one to ping off the top. Then I think I'm going to do a Genius and a Flora and Fauna to get out my Particle Cannon. That comes with two charge counters on it. One, two. All right, I can exhaust Particle Cannon, remove one charge counter from it, and deal four damage to an enemy with Overkill. So that does three and four. After you deal excess damage to an enemy, draw one card. Okay, battery pack, a pivotal moment. Um, I'm not gonna get Groot. Yeah, let's do Pivotal Moment since we're early on. Uh, five damage, because there's no threat on the main scheme. So he's going to go from 21. Five damage puts him down to 16. Okay. Another first turn. One, two, three, four, five. Ironheart, Rocket Launcher, Reload, and I've got a plan. Okay, all right. Uh, two's going on the main scheme because we have that acceleration going on. That's exciting. So two here. He's going to make an attack against me for zero, but we have two boost cards coming up. First one. Oh, this comes into play, and, oh, boy. So he does no damage to me, but we get two weapons runners. And we're going to go ahead, and we're going to see what our encounter card is. Claw attacks you. If this attack deals damage, place one threat on the main scheme. Alrighty, so he's going to attack me for zero, plus two boost cards. That's three, and that's going to deal damage, so we're going to put one threat on the main scheme. He did three damage. Okay. Um, let's see, what do I need to do after I make a basic thwart? Ironheart, draw a card, So I could clear these, or I could clear these. What do I want to do? Hmm. Draw a card. 
card. All right, so let's do this. Basic thwart on here. Then we're going to spend reload to I've got a plan. After I make a basic thwart, ready rocket raccoon. And he gets plus one thwart while in here form the rest of the phase. Then I'll thwart for three to get rid of this. Defense network. And then iron heart will thwart for... Thwart for one to get rid of the Immortal Claw. And that gets rid of 10 of his hit points. So we're down to six. Um, exhaust that. We'll deal four damage to a Weapons Runner, which will deal two damage to Claw. And after I deal excess damage to an enemy, draw a card. Battery pack. I'll put one on there. Um, excess damage. We'll beat him up. One damage. Hmm, 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 hmm. So many different ways we can go. I kind of want to get a battery pack out. But if I flip, if I discard this, I get to draw two cards like that. Then I can put this and beat them up get out this with two charge counters on it. Um, two damage to the villain with each minion. There it is. That's good. And then do I want... Yeah. Then I want Rocket's Pistol. And that's going to come in with three charge counters on it. One, two, three. And that will exhaust Rocket's pistol, remove one charge counter from it, and deal two damage to an enemy. Alright. So we get to draw up to six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And let's see how we do here. One on the main scheme. He's going to scheme for two, plus boost of two is four. So six, seven, eight. And then one from the weapons runner is going to be nine. So we're on the cusp, thanks to under surveillance. And let's see what we get for our encounter card. Ah, Melter, five damage. <laughs> we have to defend with our ally. Um, ooh, okay. Okay, after your hero thwarts, remove all threat from the scheme. Deal three damage to an enemy. Skilled investigator, clear the area. Rocket's pistol. Okay. Mm, all right, let's flip over. Let's spend a pistol to get out this uh, cybernetic skeleton. That's going to give us plus three hit points. And that's also going to give Rocket Raccoon plus one attack. So first, we're going to exhaust the rocket launcher, remove a charge, and deal two damage to the villain and each minion engaged with that player. So two damage here. Two damage here. Two damage here. He goes away. Uh, that was not excess damage. That's okay. Um, I have two attack here. Um, I 
do need to thwart. So Ironheart will do one damage to Melter. And then I'll exhaust this and do two damage to him to get rid of that. He'll go away. Um, I'll thwart for two. One, two. And then I'll spend a turn the tide to clear the area that removes two more. One, two. And I'll put out Skilled Investigator. I'll hang on to turn the tide. All right. So he's down to two health there. I'm going to get five cards. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Let's see what we get. Lockjaw. Thruster Boots, Daredevil, clear the area, plus one Thor and the aerial trade. That's pretty cool. Okay, one on the main scheme. He's going to attack for zero, plus two boost cards. Nothing, two. Two damage there. Five. Now our encounter card is going to be the villain attacks. For zero, plus two boost cards. Two, three. One, two, three. All right. That went quick. We have no side schemes in play yet. Um, plus one. Or do I want to do thwart with daredevil? Do I want plus one thwart with rocket? Lockjaw can do two attack. Mm -hmm -hmm. I do have plus one attack, so I think... Let's do that first. Let's take him out. Number two. Claw. Phase two. One revealed. Search the encounter deck and discard pile for the mortal claw. Reveal it. Shuffle the encounter deck. No, the Immortal Claw is in here. And that, where's he at? He's at 18, so 28 points. It does say to shuffle the encounter deck, so I'll shuffle the encounter deck. Okay. So he's at 28. This has three on it. One, two, three. Well, I don't know what I want to do. I don't think there's a way I can get all of the threat off, which is a bummer. Oh, yes, there is. Okay. Oh, no, there's not. Shoot. All right. Um, so I guess we will... Thwart's one, we do three damage to him. All right. Um, I'll spend Lockjaw to get out my thruster boots. That's going to give me plus one thwart, plus an aerial. And then I guess I'll spend... Oh, shoot, now i got to... Did I flip over this turn, or is that last turn? No, because I just took an attack. Um, if I exhaust this, do two damage. Exhaust this, do two damage. flip, and I discard Rocket Launcher, um, draw two cards, one, two, downtime, plus two recovery, no, but I can get out, Daredevil, 
that wrong. So one, two, three, four. Daredevil. He can thwart two off here. And he's going to do one damage to an enemy. There. All right, that's what I'm going to do. And drop to six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Use a minion for each science resource used to pay for them. Endurance, Avengers Mansion, Side Holster, ready to rumble. Ah, how about that? Alright. Two is going on the main scheme. And then he is going to scheme for two plus boost of one. So three. One, two, three. So we're still on the threshold there. And then my encounter card is going to be discard and upgrade or support you control. Um, I think that's pretty easy. I think we're going to discard skilled investigator. Um, all right. I'm going to spend it's a cheap two thwart though all right I'm gonna spend Eros to get ready to rumble out I will recover three on rocket I will flip discard discard and ready my hero I will then spend all of these to get out an Avengers Mansion. Uh, I could exhaust and draw a card, but I don't think it's going to do anything. I have plus one threat stored, so I'll remove three here. That'll knock him down from 23 down to 13. Daredevil will thwart for two. One, two. And then two damage to an enemy. Now I'll hang on to it. Just in case we get a minion. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Intuition, crew quarters, Schadenfreude. Jack flag and salvage. All right. One's going on the main scheme here. He is going to attack for one plus two. Boost cards. Five, six. That's six. Oh, baby. Six and five is 11. So I'm at nine. I'm on my last. I am literally on my last health. That was close. That was too close. I almost just got punked right there. Because um, I have three hit points. Three and nine is 12. I'm at 11. Here's our counter card. Guard minion with tough. Okay. Um, let's see, one damage from an alter ego. Um, all right, so I'm going to play salvage for Shadenfrood. I think that's how you say it. Till the end of the turn, heal two damage from rocket each time you deal any amount of damage to an enemy. Uh, Daredevil's going to thwart for two and ping off the tough. And he's going to go away. And then... Uh, let's see. Uh, Rocket's pistol will deal two damage. To that, which will heal two damage from me. And then, oh, I'll Avengers Mansion. I'll draw a card, sure. Um, oh. Um, 
Rogue Intuition to play. I've got a plan after you make a basic thwart. Ready, Rocket Raccoon. So he'll thwart for three. One, two, three. And he'll ready. Then he'll attack for one plus one is two. And that was excess damage, so I get to draw a card. And that goes away. And I heal two more damage. One damage to the villain. Each minion engaged with you. Crew quarters. Jack flag. Um, I don't think I'm doing any more damage. So I think I'm going to just play beat him up for crew quarters. Take him on a flip. I'll exhaust and heal damage. All right, Jack Flag's gonna go away. This goes away. All right, so we've exhausted our pile here. So we're gonna get an extra. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, let's see. Rocket launcher, particle canyon. <laughs> All that good stuff. One on the main scheme. He is going to scheme for two plus boost of one damage to each hero. Two on the main scheme. All right. And then in counter cards, we have two. Let's see what the first one is. The villain schemes. Awesome! Two plus boost of two is four. That will advance the scheme. Thought we could avoid it. So let's advance. Let's see what it says. Claw has found. What has Claw found? See, Claw has found a buyer for his illegal weapons. It's up to you to stop the sale, but the meeting is surrounded by Claw's cronies. Discard a card till we get a minion in play. Claw's meeting with the Crimson Cow. Claw and the mysterious figure dart into the shadows when you confront them, and Claw's minions move to cover their escape. If this stage is completed, players will lose the game. So we're going to discard until we get a minion. There's a minion. Oy. All right. Second. Uh, four. Okay. All right. That ends that. And now it's our turn. Right? Right. Let's exhaust this. Draw a card. Let's discard attack I control and draw two cards. One, two. Let's heal a damage here and let's see oh hey there's nothing on the main scheme so I can do five damage to the villain that's pretty big um, all right so we're gonna flip now let's play lockjaw for ready to rumble I'll recover three. One, two, three. And I'll flip to hero form. After you change form, discard this card. Ready your hero. Okay. Um, uh, one, two, three. We're going to put out. Particle cannon that comes in with two charge counters on it. We're going to play salvage for pivotal moment. We're going to do five damage to the villain. 
if there's no thread on the main scheme, which there's not, so 5, 13, that puts it down to 8. Right, um, so it's down to eight. Four, five, six, and it'll be just enough to not do enough. So I think what I need to do is To thwart. I need to get rid of this, I think. So thwart for three. And I'm gonna, I've got a plan. Make a basic thwart, ready racket raccoon. So three, and then I'll just thwart off the rest. This has to go away. Um, and then I guess I'll exhaust this. Deal four damage. And that will put us in a position, the old classic, if we survive this round, we will win the game. Clear the area, downtime, daredevil, beat him up, schadenfreude. All right, one on the main scheme. And he will attack for one, plus two boosts. Boost, give the villain a tough status. Boost. If this activation deals damage to you, exhaust your hero. I did one damage. That's a shame. I'm exhausted. He attacks me for one as well. And after radioactive man attacks you, discard one card at random from your hand. Okay. Discard downtime. And Mar encounter card going to be claw attacks you if this attack deals damage place one threat on the main scheme so we are accelerating claw is going to attack me hopefully for nothing did I discard a blue card oh my god I'm really good at Marvel Champions if you follow this channel, please do know that I'm very, very good at this game. <laughs> oh, man, I screw so much stuff up. But you know what? It's all about having fun, isn't it? All right. He's going to attack for one plus two and a boost. He definitely has a tough status card, which is exciting. Yes. I think we're fine though. What we're gonna do is we're gonna pay. Well, let's draw a card first. Avengers Mansion. Might as well. All right. We're gonna pay. Beat him up. Clear the area. To play, beat him up. One damage to the villain and each minion engaged with you. That pings off the tough. That does one damage to radioactive man. And then I will exhaust this and deal four damage to an enemy, and that's Claw. So, yeah, that was Claw. Um, <laughs> we, uh, oh yeah, the Rocket Raccoon Justice I thought was pretty good. Um, maybe more of a multiplayer thing. Uh, I'm not 100% sure about this discarding a tech upgrade thing. Um, I think once you run out of counters, it automatically gets discarded. But if you can add more with the batteries, I'm not sure. I played it like that because I think that's how it should be played. But I could be very wrong. I'm sure um, someone will let me know. You guys are very good at letting me know when I screw things up, which I appreciate. Because that um, helps me learn how to play the game better. Keeps my rules tight. All that good stuff. Um, yeah, so if you liked Rocket Raccoon, 
If you enjoyed this and all the Marvel Champions, feel free to give it a like, share it with your friends, all that good stuff. And until next time, have a good one.